All right, so let's try and find IO for the following circuit. Okay, so let's try and write down our node. Uh, this will be VA, this will be VB, BC, directions of current, I1, I2, I3. Let's write down our equation. So the equation for VA, everything's leaving it. So it's IO plus 4 plus I3 for VB. Uh, four uh, amps is entering it, and this is equal to I1 plus 2 IO, which is leaving it. VC, we see 2 IO and I3 are entering it, and this will be equal to I2. So let's now find the equations for our highs. So IO will be VA over 8 because the ground node is 0 volts. I1 is VB over 2. I2 is VC over 4. And I3 is VA minus VC over 1. So let's plug it in into our equation. So IO is VA over 8 plus 4 plus I3, which is VA minus VC. And for our second equation, it's 4 equals I1, which is VB over 2, plus 2 IO, which is 2 VA. So sorry, IO is VA over 8, so it'll be 2 VA over 8. And then for our third equation, it'll be 2 IO, so 2 VA over 8, plus I3, VA minus VC equals I2, VC over 4. All right, now let's simplify these more. So we have uh, uh, VA over 8, which is 0 0.125 uh, VA plus 1 VA. So it'll be 1.125 VA minus VC. And let's bring the 4 to the other side. So it'll be minus 4. Second equation, we have uh, 4. And this will be equal to VB over 2, which is 0 0.5 VB plus 2 VA over 8. So it will be 0 0.125 VA. All right. So we have 2 VA over 8. So that's uh, 0 0.25 VA plus VA. So 0 0.25 VA plus 1 VA. That's 1.25 VA. Oh, wait. I saw this. I made a mistake here. 2 VA over 8, it, it's the same here. It'll be 0 0.25 VA. And let's bring the minus VC to the other side. So it'll be VC over 4, so 0 0.25. Uh, and then we add 1 VC, so it'll be 1.25 VC. These two cancel out, so VC VA is equal to VC. Let's bring out this equation. So 1.125 VA minus VC equals minus 4. We know VC is equal to VA. So this will be 0 0.125 VA equals minus 4. Now we can do both, so both sides by 0 0.125 and we get uh, VA equals minus 32. Now we can find for IO. IO will be VA, which is minus 32, all over 8, and that gives you minus 4.